Hi, my name is Ashley. Today I'll be talking about resources on Simplifier. Simplifier is a fire registry that allows you to upload and share resources with the fire community. You can do this by searching publicly available projects, or you can create your own project and upload resources to share with your team in private projects. Today we'll be talking about how you can explore what's available on Simplifier, how you can upload your own resources, and how you can share those. Let's get started by exploring the Simplifier Fire Registry. From the Simplifier homepage, click on Explore the Registry. In this registry, you can share anything from value sets to example resources to profiles. To get started, let's filter our search results. So I know I want to see resources. I can specify the fire versioning, so let's say STU3. Let's limit our search results to profiles. And then here, under fire status, you have an option to select which fire status you're interested in. I only want to look at active material. I'm not interested in anything that's retired or a draft profile. So I'll select the first one here, SIP medication agreement. Here you can see a little bit of information about the resource. I can see that this is part of the project that Nictis has created called Nictis STU3. This is a profile on the medication request resource. And here below you have a few different options to learn more about the resource. So here in the overview tab, I now can see the differential. How I know this is the differential is by looking at it, but also you can see here on the right hand side, I have an option to select between diff and snap. The differential shows you everything that's changed in the profile in comparison to the resource that's mentioned in the specification. So this is everything that's been edited from the original resource. If I want to see everything that's contained in this resource, then I go to the snap. This is short for snapshot. Here I can see all the elements that have been changed and all of the elements that haven't been edited at all but are contained in the original resource. So that's the overview tab. If I want to go over to details, I can see a detailed description for each element in my resource. If I go to mappings, I have a detailed listing of the mappings for this resource, a table depiction of my resource. Here I can see the XML, JSON, and I can also see the history of changes. So this is a way for me to know the changes that have happened to this resource uh, in this project. So you can see that the most recent update was on October 2nd, 2017 by a user that I'm, I, I don't know who that is, but I can see that, that's, that this version has been uploaded by them. If you're logged in or you're looking at resources in your own account, then you probably have a little bit more functionality and you can see exactly which member of your group made changes to your resources. So that's really handy for tracking. But at this moment, I'm not logged in. I'm just searching publicly available resources. So this is what I have. Um, this is what's visible for me. Um, here at the top, you see a little bit more information. You can see that this is a profile and medication request, as I mentioned before. You can see the, the fire versioning, which we know that I limited my search results, so uh, I only saw SU3 results, but if you, were, uh, if you didn't select that option, then this is very handy to see which versioning. Um, this is the final status of this, and this is the first version. Uh, I have additional functionality with resources. I can download the resources. I can download as XML or JSON. I can copy them to my clipboard for further editing. And I also have uh, access to the endpoints of these uh, resources. So I can use that with my uh, Fire client and then you can go directly to the resource that you're referring to, um, whether they're my resources or resources that are public, publicly available. So that's a little bit about how you can explore the resources on Simplifier. Simplifier was originally created as a, as a portal to share uh, resources that you've created with the community. So we hope that you are doing that. We hope that you're looking at what's available on Simplifier and we hope that you're finding what you're looking for. Um, we encourage you to also upload your own resources. So that's a little bit about um, how to search resources. We'll talk further in the next video about how to upload your own resources. Thank you.